na lili di ko adan ma look no li wood. For those who have been paying attention, yeah, whenever the Lord uses me to give out and reveal what prophecies concerning some personalities, nations, kingdoms, races, languages, kings, continents, and the world at large. When I address the junior popes sudden death year, and together with some others on set, I said precisely that that man look should be prayed for, that may the Lord God help her recover and cross over. All that may come her way in the course of these sudden losses that victimize her as a, as a producer. That lady is going through a lot. This is exactly what the Lord showed me that authorized me to say the short prayer for her, her family and career. And now I'm asking everybody to put her in prayers and stop pointing accusing fingers to the wrong direction. You guys have so much mounted pressure on the woman that in her closet she has asked her creator to take away her life twice and had meditated suicide in her closet three times. So let her be alone. Leave her alone if you cannot also think and meditate upon the good things and kind gestures she also has shown to many in the past. Human beings love to ignore the strength of their fellow neighbor but rather choose to propagate their own fall and weaknesses. She has nothing to do with the past demise. Let her live her life with her family, move on and turn the next pitch of her career and destiny. Pray for her or else the next thing you hear is she's bedridden because the overthinking and stress is sucking out life. Come on gradually but surely. But you guys want to hear that she has passed on to glory before you stop battering her psychological warfare. Her greatness is not yet fulfilled, not even for the first percent of it. It is still yet to reveal itself, and she has a lot of reason to live for. So let her live and not die. This is the time she needs her loved ones the most, especially the immediate family from where she was born into. Their support and cheerfulness at this time will help her cope and quickly turn the next pitch of her life. She has been stuck in one position and the same realm of sorrowing for too long. Only this is far much more than enough to kill a person. But the light at the end of the tunnel, all this is, this mega problem that has come into her life drastically for the best, so much increase our fellowship and relationship with God like never before. And all that prayer is at least to prepare her for the next higher level in life. So she, she shouldn't give up now that the greatness of her destiny is just beginning to be revealed to the whole world. The testimony set apart by the Lord God Almighty that will make the world wonder if this was the same woman being dragged down two years from now. When you shall look behind how far you have come and just laugh at what you are feeling you are facing. And just laugh at what you are facing now. Thinking, thanking God how far he will lead you then. Blessed be God forever with this love is on the next.